So, new content, it's the 22nd of February, and I got a letter. I did log in on a character who had done the Heart of Thorns storyline, and as far as I understand, you do have to have done the Heart of Thorns storyline in order to get the letter in the mail. But it basically asks you to go to the Grove, because there's a new statue there. Oh, wow. Statue Chicha Hearn. I'm ready to go. Commander, good to see you. Blah blah blah. I wanted to see what sort of memorial you could make. It was created by survivors of the campaign against Mordrum. We could have destroyed couldn't have destroyed him with that thing. Sweet, a new letter. I wish to discuss an important matter with you. Meet me in your home as soon as possible. Okay. There's actually players here doing a memorial service for that's kind of awesome. Alright, so before you go in here and talk to the guy in your home instance, make sure that you have on you your broken Khaled bulk. You should have gotten that from doing the Heart of Thorn storyline chain. Um, if you destroyed it, you can get another one from Miani by the Mystic Forge and Lion's Arch for 10 Elonian Wines. Alrighty, so in here, I just went into the Silvari home instance. Easy as can be. Commander, I've heard you fought at North Malt with Marshall Churn and you used the sword Khaled Bold to end his life. Yes, it was his decision necessary to defeat Mortimer. The cost of killing the dragon is higher than any of us expected. I trust you brought it with you? Of course, the blade was shattered. Pale Tree's thorn may be broken, but I believe it's not so easily slain. I have it with me. So if you don't have it with you because you destroyed it, pick the Mystic Forge option that you're going to get it. I've seen it in others' hands. There's no doubt it's Khaled Bold. Please, let me take it for now. I'll be able to tell if it can be healed. I'll trust you with it for now. It's wounded, but life remains. Thank the Pale Tree. How can it be healed? Two tasks are necessary. We must gather fragments of its blade along with sources of power to bolster energy. A new wielder. Just as Khaled Bolg enhances the wielder, the blade is empowered by the bearer. You must attune yourself to the blade. Uh, okay, very well. I already have one sliver. Uh, it led me to you. Take it. What about attuning the sword? It's connected to the dream. Using the vision crystal, you can ritually commune with it and prove yourself to the sword. The spirit wood scion and an orb of natural essence. All right, and dreams of a thorn. Uh, one moat collected. There's much to be done. Collect the shards, energy from places of power. Obtain or craft a vision crystal. Obtain or craft a spirit wood scion. Obtain or craft an orb of natural essence. Sweet, so this will be under current events. Shards of a thorn. So we have one shard, and we gotta get these other ones. And that will give us our Spirit Wood Scion, and Dreams of a Thorn gives us our Orb of Natural Essence. Um, we'll also get the recipes, and then they'll end up being a bunch of skins, and apparently we'll have to make recipes for them, but we'll worry about that later. For right now, yay achievements! So here I am at the falls in the Orc Basin. Um, Westwatch Waypoint, or you can walk down from the actual city to rear, whatever suits you. But down here, like, um, at the bottom, bottom, bottom of the falls, but down right under where it looks like the mastery point is, but the mastery point's actually above you, is an entrance to a cave. Inside of this cave is a shard that we need for our colorful. Look at this. Yay. I think he can play a recording. I'm intrigued. Here I am down by Dragon's Passage at Tangled Depths. In the Tangled Depths, you glide along from where this hero point is all the way over, and you can actually fall down into the water right here. Um, I actually tend to glide all the way from up north, um, all of the Tangled Depths area that you can't see right now. Um, so I tend to glide from here, and I tend to use the updrafts to go all the way like this, 
And when you go through the deep root tangle, there's actually a giant hole that drops you down almost to where these green platforms are. But you can just glide all the way over top of them and not even have to worry about any of the mordrum and chalk and everything that live down in here. But anywho, glide over and drop down right here. This is where you want to fall into the water so that you can get this shard. See, there's the hero challenge over there. And then you can glide over to here, all the way north of this little section, and there's your water right down there. Like that. Make sure you grab an exalted beacon once you get down to it, and uh, that will help you stay alive. And then you want to swim out here, and get your shard. So once you get to the second shard, then you want to come down here by where this hero challenge is. And there's your shard of Caligol. Yay! So right here at Pact Base Camp Waypoint um, in Dragon Stand, so the very tippy top of Dragon Stand right up here, um, basically is uh, an agent that you need to talk to to get to this shard. Um, you do need to go into your story journal story journal all the way down to Heart of Thorns and Hearts and Minds and replay the chapter. Right. Once you have done that, you'll see Agent Zuri here and it's Agent Zuri will take you to the Helix instance where um, you can continue the stories for fighting, you know, redoing Mordremoth or things like that. Um, this instance in order to get to it, you have to talk to Zuri, so you have to restart the story. So once inside, just run all the way up to the top, and uh, once you do, you'll see there's the normal area with the story folks and everything, but there's also going to be now another tiny little spot where you can get onto it and get your shard of Kalenbold right over there. Do, do, do. So just come over here and wait to jump off. So here we go. We're gonna come and glide over. Ta da! Shard of a thorn! So the last shard, uh, if you go to Magellan's Valor Waypoint and come over here into the Blighted Depths, glide on back to it. The last shard of the Khaled Bulk that we need is um, right back here in the very back of the Blighted Tree over on the far west corner of it. And there it is! Got our achievement! Shard of a Thorn! So Scion is done! Now we got the other one! So yeah, just go to Verdant Brink, go over there. That's all you gotta do.